Okay, we got through uh, weekend number one, uh, successful weekend with two good results and uh, stayed healthy along the way, and uh, we prepare as we move on to the next task at hand. Dale, you got any questions? Yeah, you know, it's kind of, it's kind of an off, off topic in a way, but how are you using technology in your training? Well, technology our training I mean, based on, we, we, you know, every day we're filming our practices and uh, we'll take it back and, and watch that and uh, bring the kids in individually or through, you know, group settings. And uh, we break down, we're a big film team. We break down stuff, not only just in the game, but also in practice. That'd be our biggest asset there. And then we also have the uh, heart monitor as well. We do, you know, we manage our... Uh, you know, our minutes uh, played and, uh, you know, our heart rate, and we had take that back to the computers and understand how much miles they ran that day, how much they, you know, you know, got that heart rate up into the red category. Go ahead, Derek. What are you, what are you looking for in your next, uh, your next game? I'm uh, looking for a win, obviously. I mean, that's what we're here to do. And, uh, you know, we created a lot of opportunities in front of goal this weekend in both games. One game, we scored more goals than the other, and that's just the way it's going to be. I mean, that's just the nature of the game and, and soccer. So uh, keep being an offensive threat, you know, try to have that uh, uh, scoreless sheet on the, on the, on the defensive side and uh, you know, produce and, and score goals. Going off that, you, uh, you played in front of a, a pretty good crowds this weekend at home. How do you – take that momentum, that energy on the road with you now, neutral game first, but then a, a road contest against Minnesota? Well, at home is always, uh, you're comfortable at home. We always got a great crowd here, and for sure these girls enjoy that a lot. But, you know, we are a road team too. This is a group that's been around uh, for the most part long enough, and uh, we will take that task at hand and know that we'll go up to uh, Minnesota and play Iowa first. And uh, it's a neutral site for both teams, uh, so it'll be a neutral fan base. But, uh you know, we're, you know, we played our exhibition on the road, and we were on the road a lot last year to end the season. So going on the road doesn't scare me. It's going to be a tough game, as every game is, but it's not like, oh, my goodness, we're going on the road. Um, we'll be prepared and be ready to go. What do you expect out of those two teams? What type of teams are they being Big Ten? Oh, the Big Tens. I mean, right now, after weekend one, they got the best, I believe, uh, winning percentage at all the Power Five schools. So uh, the Big Ten is loaded with teams. We'll start with Iowa. I mean, uh, organized. Uh, have a great plan. They're hungry. They tied a Missouri team. It's a very good team. One of my old uh, teams I used to work with, and then uh, they beat Creighton. So we know Iowa's going to be a beast in a in a battle for us. And in Minnesota, we had such a great game with them last year. It was back and forth. Um, they're very talented. There'll be a, it'll be a home match for them. Uh, I expect nothing but a high energy game as well uh, with Minnesota. But you know, anytime you play a Power Five uh, team, especially on the road, it's it's going to be a good game.